Welcome back to the channel, everybody. I am McAlphanine. Please subscribe to the channel and help us get to 500 subscribers. I would appreciate that. And please turn that like button into a rocket man and send it into the stratosphere. All right, so I, I was hearing a lot about the Stellar Network being down. I did not see this at all. I didn't experience this. Um, and people were very doom and gloom about Stellar. Oh, Stellar's over. Oh, Stella's having problems. And I'm thinking to myself in my logical brain, this is a decentralized network with nodes all over the place. How could a decentralized network go down? And so I did my research and got to the core of what they're talking about. <laughs> and actually, it makes Stellar and any blockchain, any decentralized blockchain, it, it validates why they're necessary and why they're actually good. Because if one piece ceases to function, it has absolutely no effect on the rest of the blockchain. It continues to run. Stellar was still selling. St Stellar was still running. You know, you can still purchase Stellar, you know, at least from my end is what I saw. Right. So here's from the uh, Stellar Twitter account. Right. It's a statement on halted SDF validators. SDF validators. Stellar Development Foundation validators. That's very, very specific, okay? So they issued a statement. Let's read the statement and see what they're saying. Let's see if we have anything, anything to be concerned about at all. So it says, and this is from Stellar.org. It says, Stellar Network remained online and processing transactions throughout Halt. This is exactly what I saw. Like, it was no problems at all. None. None. I don't know if people want others to sell. Um, maybe some people just have a distaste for Stellar because they don't like it. You know, they have these ver very bad names for coins that don't do what they want it to do. I don't know. Maybe some people are just trolling. But transactions continued processing and it remained online. Let's read a little bit more. Around 1 a.m. PDT, the Stellar Development Foundation's validator nodes temporarily stopped validating transactions on the Stellar network. This is the Development Foundation's nodes. Key, key, that's key, okay? At the same time, SDF's public Horizon API instance also temporarily went down. At 11.28 a.m. PDT, the SDF nodes and public access Horizon were back online. That quick, just like that. During the entirety of the SDF node downtime, the Stellar network remained online. <laughs> it was perfectly fine. It was okay. Everything is okay. Let me read that again. During the entirety of the SDF node downtime, the Stellar network remained online. Because it is decentralized, didn't I just say that? It's the beauty of decentralized systems. One piece could not function and the rest of it continues on like nothing ever happened. Beautiful, beautiful. And the majority of Stellar network validator nodes were still functioning. The network continued to process transactions. The network itself did not halt. Additionally, many of those who run their own Horizon instance rather than relying on the public SDF instance, we're still able to use the API to submit transactions and query network data. SDF's engineering team worked quickly to resolve the situation by bringing new nodes and a new Horizon instance online. However, they continue to investigate the source of the issue. So they're going to make improvements, you know. They have a lot of people using, using their, their blockchain, using their technology. Things are going to happen here and there. It's a part of every business. Um, and you iron out the wrinkles. That's all. You know, but everything kept running. Transactions kept going. And you know what? I think I'm about to dollar cost average into, <laughs> into some more XLM. Why not? <laughs> the price went down and you have to buy that dip. It changes nothing. It actually shows why the system is good. Everybody was continuing to move money you know, and make money. If you're buying a dip, you were making money because it's going to go back up. Uh, nothing changes. We still have the deals on the table. We're still going to be working with CBDCs. Um, everything is still looking beautiful, but there's just 
a lot of doom and gloom channels and people out there, you know, that will uh, uh, tell you the world is ending and, you know, same type of individuals that tell you there's a market crash when it's just a minor correction, healthy correction. They'll tell you everything is crashing. The world is burning. You know, what can you do? Through it all, buy the dip. I buy the dip. Through it all, I'm going to dollar cost average. And through it all, I know what I hold. And so I'm going to hold still. Now that you have that information, what are you going to do about it? Subscribe to the channel, please. I appreciate that. Let's get to 500 subscribers and turn that like button into a rocket and send it straight to the moon where we all want to go. And until next time, let's get to the money.